it is time to go to Italy. What a feast. It's like 105 degrees. Get my stuff ready. My passport wouldn't scan. <laughs> hey everybody, it is departure day. It is time to go to Italy. I'm really excited. I'm very anxious. Um, flight travel, just the whole bit of flight travel is a big anxiety trigger for me. Um, but I'm pushing through because I'm excited and looking forward to the trip. So I'm just going to show you my domestic travel day from here home to Chattanooga to Atlanta and then once we get on the big plane in Atlanta. Great time. Bye. Bye. Maybe I can just do a shot. Help me. We're checked in. We are through security with about a little over 30 minutes to spare until check in. So this uh, airport is tiny. I'll show you a little bit more of it when uh, we're done here. Right now we are at the bar. That's a good drink. <laughs> That's pretty good. That's really tasty. Yeah. So there's just six gates. They're all right here. Very small. There's the bar that we were just at is just on the other side of this wall and there's seating back there too. And then this little area we can get a few foods, snacks, and things. That little area back right there. More seating over there. Oh, here is one of the gates right here. Oh, two gates are over here. Number two. Number two. Number one. So, gates two through six are back there. made it to Atlanta and the flight was just fine. There was a little bit of turbulence but not bad at all. Those flights from Chattanooga to Atlanta are so quick. So we are now at TTF Friday. Alright, first up some yummy looking mozzarella sticks. I'm gonna try one without the sauce first. All the flavor is really good. Yeah, delicious. What a feast. Buffalo wings and what was that? Uh, whiskey glaze. Whiskey glaze ribs. And I went for a bacon cheeseburger and a side salad. Also, I meant to say earlier, when we landed, we, we had like three hours until um, boarding time so we've got plenty of time so we're just gonna hang out here a while eat hang out maybe have dessert after all right we're at our gate it's 5 57 and boarding time starts at 7 20 so we're just gonna chill for a while i'm not feeling as anxious as i was last time we had our last meal plenty of time all right it's 7 43 and it's about to be our time to board. Um, we've had a very relaxing time. I don't usually have layovers this long. Um, the layover was, I guess, about three hours long, but it's been really nice actually. Very low stress. We can kind of do whatever we want. We went to dinner and then we shopped around for an eye mask 
and then we've just been sitting here chilling, so. I'm not feeling as much anxiety this trip as I was um, last time, partially because I'm not having to travel alone this time. And I think maybe partially because the layover was so long and the whole time I just know that we've had plenty of time. So right now we're waiting to find out if, um, so we're in a row of three and we're waiting to find out if uh, there's a third person with us in a row or if there's not. So hopefully there's not and we can spread out even a little bit more. So get my stuff ready. They've got this electronic face yeah, recognition thing where you scan your passport and they scan your face at the same time. And I'm wondering if we don't have to scan our ticket. I don't know. I'll find out. Normally big flights like this have Wi-Fi, um, which is not very like good or fast or anything for like downloading, but um, it's usually enough to do some iMessages, but I got the notification a little bit ago that there's not gonna be any Wi-Fi on this flight, which is fine. Not the end of the world. I was just gonna use it to do some messaging. So it is an overnight flight. We're gonna, so it's about 7.46 p.m. like I said. And by the time we land in Rome, it's gonna be 11 Rome time. So I think that's gonna be like around 5 a.m. Um, home time, Eastern, Eastern time. So um, I'm gonna try to sleep. I'm gonna have my um, normal sleeping pill that I always take. And then I'm gonna have these, they're um, wireless headphones and also noise canceling and then I'm gonna use my headache cap um, to block my eyes and everything. There's probably gonna be dinner but we're not gonna eat dinner because we already ate dinner. I'll show you what our suits are like once we get there. It's like 105 degrees. Oh, um, But we're in our seats and people are still coming on. This plane is massive. So there's three seats on this side, three seats on that side, and three seats over on the other side. I think up in like first class and everywhere, it's probably less seats. Well, I don't know because I've never been in first class. <laughs> um, it's so hot, but we're thinking the air will come on once the plane like turns on and starts moving and everything. So. <laughs> oh, let me talk about this for a minute. There's a little headphone jack because you can watch stuff. Um, these are just new releases, but. I don't know, mine's like having problems. Um, anyway, oh, Paramount Plus picks. Um, let me see what's in here. Anyway, lots of stuff you could watch. You could plug in your headphone jack there. And there's this USB here to charge your devices. Tree table here. Yep, I'll have to put that right back up, but anyway. Oh, cute. You can make it big or small and it's still that thing. We got the seat. Yeah. So I think I mentioned that earlier. We were hoping that nobody would sit in the third seat in our row and it looks like nobody's going to sit there. So we are stoked about that. We're going to spread out. I have ever requested an aisle seat because it's just it's, it's what's best for my anxiety and um, getting up to pee and stretch my legs and everything. So, um, but now that there's nobody in this other seat, um, it's going to be fantastic for spreading out and sleepies and everything. So, I'm really, really thrilled about that. So here's my seat. Here's this whole seat, and then 
he's way over here. So. so they offered plug-in headphones for this, which I don't have, so I accepted that. And then a, an eye mask, which I did bring my headache cap, so I probably won't use this, but I would just want one just in case. Oh my gosh, it's getting serious. Um, if they don't have Taylor Swift, they're canceled. <laughs> Okay, no Taylor Swift, but that's still pretty cool. Thanks so much for watching and stay tuned for all my videos from Italy. Um, my passport couldn't scan. <laughs> um, so that caused a lot of anxiety, but then I just went to the place with the, that wasn't automated and it was a uh, border agent and it scanned and not through. So.